Sophia cafeteria and we're all eating and we're having some fun. Everybody introduce himself for the camera. Hi, I'm Rowanna. Okay. Maria. Everyone knows Keek so far. We could have been in the music video for this. Drake was Why were you there? Because we were one are you kidding? Hey, no. Imagine the promo we saw. Yeah. You look fun as well. We're having a hot and mean concert. Do what? Slowly getting turned. Let's do it. And it goes. I like Round two with hot and mean. We're still going. More people joined us. The nice people next to us are still giving us free things. Osaka this guy. Yes. Hi. Yes. Push. Hi. Squish. Wait, everyone say hi! Hello to the camera! Woo! I don't exactly know what's going on, but we're gonna go get food and we adopted some Japanese people along the way. <laughs> Me. What's going on, you guys? Hi. Say hi. hi. Everyone, say hi to the camera. Oh, yes. Say hi. Hello. Hi. Oh, it's a camera. It's hi. A camera. It's on. Hi. It's on film, you guys. Hi. Yes. Hi. Woo. Hello to the camera. It is day four of Japan, and um, today we went had a hanami. So. Um, those who don't know it, it's the, I guess like the traditional gathering or like Americanized like picnic of people going and drinking is very much involved um, and just like doing that under the sakura blossoms and I think you could do it like normally, just like on a normal basis but it's very popular and something to do when it is sakura season so it was really cool that I was able to do that. Um, it was really really cool because I feel like I experienced a a true Hanami because I was with a bunch of people that I liked and we were having fun and eating and drinking but was really um, really amazing and I guess a true test to Japanese hospitality was this a large group of um, elderly Japanese people like offered to sit for us to sit on our tarp and um, honestly I think they gave us so much food like they gave us meat they gave us sweets they gave us free alcohol, it was like free sake, like really expensive sake and they it just, different ones just can't, kept coming over and they really tried to speak English with us and for us to really try this like traditional Japanese, um, like this, real, I don't even know what it was, like this Japanese drinks, um, they gave us plates, they gave us like their food, their Tupperware, it was just honestly really really touching and like the fact that they kept doing it was um was really awesome and then we tried to like give food back to them and then they ended up giving us more food and we took pictures with them and it was honestly an amazing experience feeling really happy to experience just something i guess truly japanese and to be able to be like hanging out with some really awesome people so far and um tomorrow the plan is to go to the tokyo sky tree so we shall see if that happens or what new adventures will I will run into. So yeah, good night. I think it is only day five and we are tempted by McDonald's and it did its experience, so. 
How is everyone's so McDonald's tasting today? Really good? Yes. Any difference from either the UK or America? Yes. And the fries are not as greasy. Okay. And the texture is real. Real? It's real. It's getting it's real? real. Okay. <laughs> On to the other ones. How are we feeling about McDonald's? Great. It's good? A plus. Pretty good. Pretty good. <laughs> Any big differences? Yeah. Any astounding comments to make? The sizes are much smaller. That's yeah, very yeah. true. This is, this, this is this is a small. small. <laughs> a small in America is twice the size of that. <laughs> food for thought. Literally. Very much. <laughs> so exciting! Oh, so many people. people. We're about to see. Yeah, we're about to see Shibuya Crossing. Let's check it out. Tell me the size of You got nothing? No? Alright. So I think I'm gonna break it. <laughs> hey, Neve. I don't know why the cage bird sings. I'll you with that, Maya. We're at McDonald's part two. Um, this time around, I got a McFlurry, and you can't go wrong with fries. What did you get? Literally the most basic ice cream cone that you can find in America and french fries. Do you taste any difference? It's literally the same. The same? Alright. McDonald's capitalizes everywhere. Alright. So. Hey Neve, how about you? What did you get? Same. It's float. Uh, really any know. thoughts on it? It is so good. It's so good. You guys what does it taste like? It's like a strawberry soda and ice cream. Very, very fancy. Something you can't find in America, right there. And this is my meal. And it does actually taste exactly the same. Reporting in, it's 12.25. We are alive and well. Thriving. We're still walking. <laughs> We're breaking in our platform shoes. It hurts. We Let's check it out. Fucked up the exit. <laughs> <laughs> we definitely fucked up an exit. Okay. Our feet hurt, but our shoes are bitching. <laughs> <laughs> Our shoes are awesome, but I'm going to feel it feel it a lot later. Um, we definitely messed up on some exits. Apparently trains definitely did right. some illegal <laughs> shit to get out. Um, apparently, planes stop running at 1 a.m. Say planes. Planes? I said planes. <laughs> I promise I need, to go to I need to go to bed. So trains. Trains stop running at 1 a.m. Um, so pretty much the choices are you need to get home by 1 a.m. because if you don't, you're stranded and you better find a place to go to sleep or you, you're gonna walk. And if, if we're going to Shibuya tomorrow, it takes four hours to get there if we're walking. So uh, we gotta be smart tomorrow. And we're still walking. We could take a bike. <laughs> or we could take a bike. Do some more illegal shit by stealing a bike. Something along those lines, but uh, yeah. Japan at night. Very, very quiet. Hello, or a good night to everyone. So again, let's review what we happened today. And we went grocery shopping, which was very, very interesting. But um, definitely, grocery shopping was an adventure. The initial plan was to go to Tokyo Skytree, but it was all really, really cold and pretty foggy today, so we're like, okay, let's just go to Shibuya. And it was amazing. It was like, to see the crossing, and then to see what like goes on in all of it, it's just so surreal, because that's something you see on TV, that's something you see on YouTube videos or in pictures. Um, it's like Shibuya Crossing, so it was really, really cool to be able to go there and to walk around, and um, that was a very like, wow, I'm in Tokyo moment. I met some more people from more places, um, 
one from New Zealand, um, some from Mexico, where else, like more places from the United States, like Texas, East Coast. It's been amazing to meet so many people from all over the globe and um, to be able to hang out with them. The goal for day six is to be really, really healthy. I actually want to go like running, go run around Matsudo, um, eat healthy because at night we're going clubbing. So I will check in with that later and we'll see how that goes. So good night, retainer.